Hello my wolf pack and welcome to PBAL week 3 where we are battling Gord Bear or I think that's how you say it or God Bear, I don't know how you, how you pronounce it but G-A-W-D um, and this team is scary um, honestly Manaphy, big problem Tinkerton, big problem Reggie Draco, probably Scarf with Draco Meteor, big problem Galarian Zapdos, big problem um, Ogapon, big problem Masquerade Definitely here for that, um, sorry, definitely here for, um, pulling a, a sticky web, and it's probably going to be focus sashed. Now, with that in mind, that is likely going to be the lead, so let's go with, um, walking wake, also we've got walking wake now on our team. Uh, Walking Wake, I got rid of Glamora and knocked out and I replaced it with um, Walking Wake just because Glamora wasn't really doing it for me anymore. Um, I know I used it in a few previous seasons and it worked out really well for me, but I just, I don't know, it just wasn't jiving with the team properly. And yeah, almost can guarantee there's going to be a Masquerade lead here. Um, formerly buff, yeah. So, expect to see a sticky web right now. Um, that is fine. Intimidate is fine. I do get my booster up, so that's handy. Um, my speed is heightened, which is useful. Um, I am going to obviously use... <sighs> He's almost definitely sashed. What comes in? I mean, Manaphy can come in. But I am going to just flamethrower here, because I expect it's going to go for Sticky Web. And yeah, it's going to be sashed 100%. Oh, wow, no, okay, so it probably was sashed, but I didn't do enough power to, to take it out, apparently, so, you know. Um, right, what comes in now? I kind of want to surf. I think I'm going to surf here, just because that will... Oh, this is the first time I've, I've actually used Walking Wake, and I didn't realise it had two tails. Wow. Um, I'm going to use surf here, because I think that, one, that guarantees the killer Masquerade. Two, um, if Tinker Tongue comes in... Manaphy, if that comes in, that is a big problem. I won't lie, that is a big problem for me. Um, it does get a tail glow up pretty much for free at that point, which is not something that I want to happen. Um, does stay in. Does stay in. Um, so, it's, it, it, to be fair, Masquerine did its job there, which um, I will give... Like, I, I knew that that was a chance. I didn't think he actually would bring it. However, my ability to remove hazards is absolutely abysmal. So... Um, I'm not surprised that came. And I, to be fair, I am running a pretty fast team. Um, I have got Choice Scarf on Heracross. So even at minus one, it still has a decent speed. Um, Shakira... Is it Shakira, he said? Okay, Shakira. Um, right, we definitely outspeed this thing. I would quite like to flip turn. Just to kind of get some switchability in. Um, now this thing realistically goes for a fairy type attack. And I can definitely bring in Gengar here. Or I can bring in Slowbro. But let's go for Flip Turn. Unless this thing is Choice Scarfed. If this thing is Choice Scarfed, then I die. But that gives me some good information. So I'm going to Flip Turn here. Yeah, so that isn't Choice Scarfed or anything. Uh, we do get a bit of chip damage off. We don't see an item yet. Um, the most sensible play here is definitely Slowbro. And I thought I put Rocky Helmet on it, but apparently I put Leftovers in. I know I wasn't sure on that, but... Yes, uh, let's go into Slowbro here. I think that is the most sensible play. Um, caught in the sticky web, it really doesn't matter with Slowbro. Really does not matter with Slowbro. Uh, go to the light screen. Okay. I see you. I see you. I didn't go for Flamethrower this week. Um, right, now, if I was to switch... Nothing directly wants to switch in here. I think I'm going to go for a Surf. He's not going to bother switching. This could do I don't know if he gets Swords Dance. Okay, more Hazards. He's really gone on the Hazard ha hazard front. I did very almost put Heavy Duty Boots on Shen Pao as well. So, kind of that limits my switching here. Um, well, Surf does nothing. Quite literally nothing. Um... I could go into Gengar, but Gengar, again, can't really do a huge amount. 
Uh, I am running a very special team this week. Um, do I just try and run out some of the turns of our light screen here? I think that'd be sensible. I, I don't know. I can see it switching this turn. I can see it switching. I'm going to make a risky play. I can see a switch coming. Use reflect. Okay. Okay. So this thing only has one move. So once we see it, uh, he's probably thinking, why, why on earth would I do that there? But uh, the fact is that I don't think this gets any good Manaphy coming out. Ariana the Gorgeous Royal it is Manaphy, okay. Um, so, realistically, the Mon that I have to deal with this... Okay, so leftovers. The Mon I have to deal with this is Florges. So let's go into Florges here. Because Florges should be... A, after Tail Glow, it is very risky, though. After Tail Glow, it is 100% very risky. I could get 6 0 again here very easily. Um, this could happen again. Uh, and I didn't bring Haze. I didn't bring Haze again. I considered it. Special attack raises. Special defense. And is it. What else does it do? I thought Take Heart did three things. Now, I have got a little bit of investment in my special attack here. So, I can do a little bit. I think I've got a little bit of investment. Let's go for the Giga Drain. Let's see how much it does. Realistically, on the light screen, it's not going to do much. Uh, he is setting up big time here. I should have 100% had Haze. Um, <laughs> that's plus two now. That is not good. That's going to do nothing. Yeah, that does literally nothing. Literally does nothing. Oh, my goodness. Dude, I am so screwed. So 100% screwed. Um, do I just try firing off Moonblast to try and lower its special attack? That's what I think I'm going to have to try and do. Try and look. Oh my goodness. Is he going for the plus six setup? Because realistically, that is going to be a massive pain on my backside if that happens. Okay, we do get the special attack drop there, which is kind of handy. Um, I, light screen can't have much longer. Oh, wait. Does that come up on... Uh, okay, light screen must only have a turn left. We're going to keep on going for Moonblast here. You know, this thing is scary. Um, we don't get the drop. We don't get the drop. Light screen is up, surely. Yeah, light screen is off. Um, I have to keep on going for Moonblast. He could definitely go for an attack here. He might have a high enough uh, attack stat. Acid armor. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. I see you. I see you. Okay, we do get another special attack drop, though, which is kind of handy. It's kind of handy. I should have to kind of keep on going Moonblast. The thing is, though, if this is a max speed Manaphy as well, then it definitely outspeeds everything that I have. No, no drop. Okay, um, I'm a little bit scared now. I'm a little bit scared. I'm very... Well, no. I'm very scared. Uh, right. We have to try and go for Giga Drain here. It goes for Stored Power. That probably takes me out. Doesn't. Okay. That does nothing. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Gracious me. Wow. Okay. Why didn't I bring Haze? I considered Haze. Why didn't I bring it? Such an idiot. Such an actual moron. Like a full-on actual idiot is what I am. You have to go for another Giga Drain. I'm going to let this thing go down. Obviously, his last attack has to be a water attack, I'm assuming. 
This thing is just too set up now. I really, really wish I'd brought Haze and Heavy Duty Boots. I messed up massively. Um... thing is it will be without speed yeah that's be heracross i've got to try gengar and hope that it's not speed invested i've got to try gengar hope it's not speed invested and i still at speed i don't think i'm going to though i'll be honest i really don't think i am i think i'm in a pretty dire situation here my hope is that i outspeed and thunderbolt gets the paralysis but I don't think I'm going to outspeed. I think he's got enough speed investment to definitely outspeed me. Uh, which he does. That's fair. Um, gosh. Oh, okay. That actually could be huge. That actually could be pretty big. That could. Well, no. It probably isn't. But it could be. It, it has the capacity to be. Um, why did I not worry so much about Manaphy? Oh, my goodness. Um... <laughs> I don't know what to do. Let's just check my stats. Um, okay, stats. Special, 176. Oh, gosh, that's the wrong one. I have to check. Right, special, 176. 194. I think I've got to get Heracross here. I've got to get Heracross. I think that's about where it was. Um, I've got a Terra. So there's Terra. And there's close combat. That's what I've got to do. That's what I've got to do. I don't know what chance I've really got now. I'm just hoping that I'm able to kill this thing somehow. Um, I haven't really got a huge plan. I haven't really got a huge plan. This could definitely have a ghost type attack. Not a ghost type, a fairy type attack. If it does, then that would be... Oh, the fairy against fairy is neutral, so that's fine. Um, okay, that's not dreadful. It could be much worse. <laughs> Does nothing. Oh my goodness. How, I did not realize how bulky Manaphy was. Oh my goodness. I did not realize that capacity. Um Yeah, we are we are screwed. We're officially just screwed. Oh, um yeah, of course I'm choice scarf. I forgot about that. Uh So Dazzling Gleam is the other move. So no fairy type move. Oh, God, I kind of wish Cursed Body would have activated on that instead. Um... Definitely outspeeds Chien Pao. A minus one. I think that's the only thing I can play next. I think that is the only thing I can play. I am so regretting not bringing heavy duty boots and haze. Like that was they literally in my plan. That was the two things that I had kind of there. Um, we kind of have to just go for crunch here. Hope we outspeed. I don't think we do. Uh, no, it does outspeed. So that's um, us dead as well. You know. <sighs> You know, I haven't been on my game recently. I've been really off my game. And the fact that I'm about to get 6 0 twice in a row. Um, to be fair, he saw the way to do it 100% and he went for it. Um, 100%. He saw how to do it and he did it. So I'm not mad. I'm mad at myself. I'm mad at myself. Um, 
There's no way I can see myself getting out of this unless, you know, Slowbro acts as a massive G and just gets crit upon crit upon crit. But, yeah, I don't think that we have a chance here. Um, we're going to Psychic. It probably goes for Dazzling Gleam, realistically. It does go Store Power. Okay. Um, wow, well, that does a lot of damage. So, yeah, that's a GG. That is a GG, unfortunately. Um, does next to nothing. I, guess, I think it recovers more than they did. But, yeah, GG. Honestly, um... I didn't plan for it right. I didn't plan right. I've got 6 0 twice in a row. I think this is the the, the, the first time I've been 6 0 twice in the league. I think this is the third and this is the third time I've ever been 6 0 Um obviously, you know, I've lost some of my skill. Um Fact is, uh that you know I used to make my competitive guys, I used to be um really aware of what moves Pokemon had and stuff and what they did, and now I'm less so. And that's definitely showing. 100% that is showing here. Um, there is literally zero way that we can we can win this. Um, like, 0-0. Zero, zero. Um, so, that's a GG. Um, well done, dude. Honestly, you know, you that, that was actually really well played. Um, there wasn't any antics there. You 100% saw how to win and you did it. So, yeah, I'm not, I'm not mad at you. I'm mad at myself. Um, if that, that's, if that anger's coming, coming across, then, yeah. Um, yeah, I'm mad at myself for, again, literally, at the last second, I had to make the decision between Swords, Dance, or Haze on Chien Pao. And, again, I changed, literally, as I was putting it into Pokemon Showdown, I changed from Heavy Duty Boots to Life Orb, because I thought, nah, Heavy Duty Boots don't need them. And, you know, had that have happened, I think that we potentially... Would have, wouldn't have won, but we potentially would have had a better differential. Um, so yeah, no, GG dude, honestly, that was um, poor prep on my part, poor decisions, and yeah, you saw you saw the way to win, and you did it. So yeah, GG. Um, thank you if you watched this to the end. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this, seeing me get my butt kicked again. But yeah, I hope you had a good one, and I'll see you soon.